adverbs. An adverb is a word which adds to the meaning of a verb and tells us how a thing is done, when it is done, or where it is done. Read the sentences given below. The peacock dances gracefully. My mother was quite happy when I received the award. Mr. Chandra works very hard. The words gracefully, quite, very are all adverbs. In sentence one, the adverb gracefully modifies the verb dances. In sentence two, the adverb quite modifies the adjective happy. In sentence three, the adverb very modifies the adverb hard. Kinds of adverbs. There are six kinds of adverbs. First, adverbs of manner. Second, adverbs of place. Third, adverbs of time. Fourth, adverbs of frequency or number. Fifth, adverbs of quantity or degree. Sixth, adverbs of interrogative. Seventh, relative adverbs. Adverbs of manner. Adverbs of manner express the way or the manner in which actions are done. They answer the question how. Examples: Rohan entered the room quietly. The boy runs quickly. The patient slept soundly. Adverbs of manner usually end in li. We form these adverbs by adding ly to adjectives. Bad, badly, great. Greatly, but some adverbs of manner do not end in ly. Anand played well; they worked hard. Adverbs of place. Adverbs of place tells us where things happen or where the actions are performed. They answer the question where. Examples: My mother is sitting outside. The birds flew away. All the students are downstairs. The most common adverbs of place are given here: up, down, out, near, upstairs, away, outdoors, inside, outside, nowhere, somewhere, backward, here, there, in, everywhere, sideways, indoors. Adverbs of time. Adverbs of time tell us the time: today, yesterday, tomorrow, daily, lately, ago, etc. When someone does something or when some action is performed, they answer the question when. Examples: Anil met me yesterday. The train will arrive soon. The salesman came late. Some common adverbs of time are: before. Yesterday, never, formerly, today, daily, tomorrow, early, now, soon, late, already, ago. Adverbs of frequency or number. Adverbs of frequency or number express how often someone does something or how often an action is performed. They show how often. Examples. I called at your office twice. The bus was nearly overcrowded. She is always late for school. Some common adverbs of frequency or number are always, weekly, fortnightly, annually, again, never, once, twice, usually, seldom, daily, monthly, ever, frequently, often, generally. Adverbs of quantity or degree. An adverb of quantity or degree tells how much or to what degree or to what extent a thing is done. Examples: Rachita treats his servants very badly. Rohan is too careless. His face was extremely red with anger. Some common adverbs of quantity or degree: almost, quite, as. So, enough, nearly, too, more, most, entirely, completely, just, very, 
hardly, slightly, fairly, badly, rather, barely, deeply, only, much, far, really. Adverbs of interrogative. Interrogative adverbs are used for asking questions. Examples. When will they come? Time. Where is your house? Place. Relative adverbs. Relative adverbs modify words and refer to things or persons that pronouns refer to. Why, when, where, and how are relative adverbs. For e examples, Mother has forgotten the time when she took her medicine. I have no idea how the fly got into the pan.